Hey you, welcome back. So today I want to give you some ideas of ways that you can organize what I like to call our craft closet, our game closet, whatever it is that you call it at your home. We have so many, you know, board games, card games, you know, just different games for our kids. My kids are, they just love games. I mean, they get so many at Christmas time just because they love them. We love to do family game nights. We take our games with us when we go camping. So I was looking for a way to organize organize them. Now, I'm a 31 consultant. I have been for eight years, and I'm still finding areas in my home where I need better organizing. And so, I was kind of cleaning out our, we have those rubber made um, like drawers, you know, that are on wheels, you know, and we have those in our closet so I can organize in drawers. But I was finding that, you know, all the games that were in the boxes and stuff, like they never go back in the box, especially some of these I'm going to show you. They never like go back in the box, and so the box never really closes, and then I can't fit as many in the drawer as I could if they did, and it's just it's very aggravating. Um, so anyways, I was like, you know what? I came downstairs to my office and I got some of my zipper pouches and I went upstairs and I'm like, oh my gosh, this is so perfect. Like, why have I not done this before? So I'm just going to share some ways um, that you can organize your, you know, game closet and things like that. So I have used in this... Um, um, organizing. I've used the zipper pouches, the mini zipper pouches, and the size up expandable pouch. So there's different ways, you know, so many ways that you can use these items. But what makes it even fun is that when you personalize them, you know exactly what's in there. Speaking of, look at this one, okay? So this is the zipper pouch in that patchwork stripe print, and I just personalized the fish on there, okay? So I know exactly what's in here. It's my daughter's fish game. And I was not sure if this would fit in here, but it did. So this is her little go fishing game. It fits perfectly in here and the little fishing poles, which I'm not going to grab out because I don't want them to fall. But that's her little fishing game. So it just fits right in here. Now that box for the fishing game was like double the size of this. And so I have minimized my space with this zipper pouch. Now something great about our zipper pouches is where you can bundle and save with these. Okay. Um, so if you get two, you get them for $28 together. So if you buy two together, and it is a different item code. When So when you're typing in the search zipper pouches, you'll see two that comes out, comes up. So click the one that says two zipper pouches, and then you scroll down, and that's where you pick your print, okay? And sometimes people it gets people confused, but scroll, when you're bundling and saving, scroll down, and you'll see two rows of prints, okay? Pick a print in each row, and then add it to your card, okay? So this is our little zipper zipper pouch for the go fish. Then I have a zipper pouch for our Jenga. Okay. Now me personally, the Jenga box was okay. I would, you know, fit all, you know, you type, you know, you fit them all in and the box would close. But my kids for some reason cannot do that. And so like the box would never close. It'd be wonky and everything. And so I thought, you know what? Zipper pouch it is. So I did zipper pouch and you can see that it's bulky, but when you lay it down, just do like this and it will flatten right out. So Jenga is in here and all of the Jenga pieces are in here. So um, super fun that they're all together and I don't have a cardboard box that's either ripped or it won't close, everything is in here. And then um, we'll just keep on with the zipper pouches. This is mine. This one's mine. So in one of our little Rubbermaid drawers, I had a little, uh, like a, I don't even know. It's probably like from Lowe's, like a little zipper pouch from Lowe's. I mean, I've, we've been married for 16 years and so I've had that thing for 16 years. And I'm like, why do I not have a 31 one? So anyways, I thought, you know what? My tools are going to go in this one. So I put Mrs. Fix It in here and I did this. Oh, and I forgot to tell you guys, these, um, uh, the, uh, what is it called? The font. I did the modern font on these because I love how thick and bold it is. This is the charcoal thread color on the soft camo. And this is also that modern font. And I did that in the blush, the blush to go on here, which I think is really cute. Now in here, you can, you'll, you know exactly what's in here. I have all of my tools. So I have, um, you know, uh, screwdrivers, flathead screwdrivers, pliers. I have, um, I think there's like a, you know, tape measure, all that stuff. There's even a flashlight in here. So I love that I have my own little bag now. I know exactly what's in there. And then Roma Cube. Okay. We love Roma Cube at home, but we really love it when we go camping and the box the same way. Like it just doesn't go back in there for some reason. So I was like, I've got to have a zipper pouch for our Roma Cube. So I've got all of our Roma Cube little stands in there and then all of the tiles 
um, back there on the back and it just it's, it's, it's just perfect and then here you can see that I have our um, these are our mini zipper pouches now this is an old print so uh, you know we don't have this print available anymore but I have uno on this one and then on this one we have old mate so these um, are from our camper and so our kids love um, having these little zipper pouches and plus those little cardboard boxes that they come in they rip and you know it's just a pain so I love having these little zipper pouches now one thing oh let me show you some more that I have and then I'll get into all that this is I have this is the zipper pouch here and I have my daughter's light bright in here so that was another thing like and then all the little pieces so I have the little light bright things and just a little ziploc bag but you could easily get one of our zipper pouches and put in here but the light bright oh my gosh it's just a perfect fit now I love in those rubbermaid drawers these just stack on top of each other or you could stand them up and and do them that way but I think um you know you can flatten them out when they're laying here and you can fit more in there so um, and then also we have our size up expandable pouch here so um, I actually have it zipped up so I'll just show you what's on the inside I just have all of these little games in here so my kids love these little tic-tac-toe games that you can get like at Walmart you know at Christmas or the holidays we even have the little um, the wooden games like you see at Cracker Barrel so I love that all of these are in one little pouch and you could easily get the little zipper the mini zipper pouches for these so I'm gonna zip this back up and show you this is it, you know, closed, uh, collapsed down. But all you have to do is, if you need a bigger pouch, just unzip the middle and expand here. And you've got a taller pouch here. So if you have taller games and things like that, that may work for you, okay? Now, some ways that you can keep all of this organized. So say you don't have those Rubbermaid totes to keep things in or you're, you know, you just may have a closet that you need to put on, you know, things on shelves. Remember that when you are shopping, we have an awesome customer special. For every $50 that you spend, you get a 50% off item, okay? So if you get several zipper pouches, you're gonna qualify for a half price item. So how can we keep this stuff organized, okay? So some suggestions for if you have a lot of the little mini zipper pouches, I would suggest grabbing our tiny utility tote okay so this is our tiny utility tote it's the tiny version of our large utility tote okay and these little mini zipper pouches just fit perfectly in here okay so if you have a lot of like phase 10 you know all those little different card games get you um get you mini zipper pouches and then that you can fit i mean probably I don't know 10 of those in here okay so that's a perfect little solution for the mini zipper pouches also if you have um the reg if you're getting the regular zipper pouches you might consider doing a double duty caddy to keep them in here so i can fit two of two zipper pouches on each side you know, so I could fit more over here and then have this little caddy for all of our games. So if it's game night, you can just get out your caddy and, you know, go from there. Now, um, another one, if you have a lot that may work for you, this is called the deluxe double duty caddy. Okay. So it's kind of the upgraded version. You've got uh, double sides here. You've got a pocket here to store things. And then back here, you've got pockets. So if you have your all your games can fit in here I'll do my Mrs. Fix It <laughs> and how about Jenga so and then I can put on this side mini zipper pouches so mini zipper pouches here two games on this side two games on this side and then even this flap here I could put those little tic tac things or a lot of times we have like dice and pegs and uh, just little things that we don't want to lose you could put those in this front section and be completely organized in your gaming section of your home so I was so excited when this all came together and it looks so much nicer upstairs and I really have made so much room by condensing things into these little 31 zipper pouches so um, I'll link everything below that way you can decide what's going to work for you and you can click on it and take you right to my website and you can figure out what prints you want and how you want to personalize yours so like this is the little starfish so I put the light bright in here and then you know like the Jenga is in camo I kind of thought camo was good for Jenga I don't really know why but anyways thanks so much for watching you guys if there is an area in your home that you are wanting to organize let's think about having you join one of 
my gift clubs. So it's a six month club and you can spread out your spending and one of the months you actually get the rewards from the club and you can earn free stuff and half price items and things like that. So um, I'll link below that information as well. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if, you're shop if you are shopping, you don't have a consultant, I'm gonna link below my VIP group. So you can click to join my VIP group on Facebook, answer the two questions, and I'll send you a private message. So make sure that you check that message request folder, people you know folder, or like a spam folder. And hopefully you'll see that message back for me. If you're not seeing a message from me, click on my personal name on Facebook and then click message like you're going to send me a message and you'll see my reply. You'll see my message to you. So hopefully we'll get you added to my VIP group on Facebook. Thanks so much for watching, y'all. Have a great day. Bye.